Good morning and welcome to this special split edition of 22 News at 630. I'm Rich Tedemer. And I'm Tamara Sikarzik inside of MGM Springfield. This is really the day we have all been waiting for and we've been waiting years for it. The grand opening of MGM Springfield will happen at 11 this morning. That's when this casino will be packed with people who have been waiting such a long time to see what it looks like. But it looks like some people may have already been gambling because we found this voucher for 60 cents. So maybe I can use this later and try and win big like everyone else will be doing today here at the casino. If you take a look behind me, we are on the gaming floor this morning. 125,000 square feet of this gaming floor and you can see the slot machines are lit up. They are ready to go and I guarantee every single one of them will be used at some point today. Thousands of people are expected to line up this morning to see MGM Springfield in person. For many people, this is more than just a casino. It's a representation of the past and present of the city of Springfield. If you head to the hotel lobby, you'll see bookshelves with yearbooks from local high schools. There's also 125,000 square feet of gaming space, like I said, a bowling alley, a movie theater, a hotel, and several different restaurants. If you're planning to join the party in downtown Springfield, you're being encouraged to find parking at the Big E in West Springfield. 22 News Reporter Taylor Knight is live on the shuttle bus with everything you need to know. Hey, Tamara. MGM Springfield has plenty of restaurants that will be serving food to people on opening day. 22 News Reporter Ciara Speller is live inside of Tap Sports Bar to show us how they're preparing. That's right. Right now we're giving you a live look inside the tap here at MGM Springfield. With the opening of the MGM Casino, Springfield is entering a new era and so is law enforcement. 22 News anchor Barry Krieger found out that police have developed new techniques to keep you safe. Like I wouldn't go out late, late, late at night by myself. MGM Springfield will officially open their doors to the public at 11 this morning. Before that, at 1030 this morning, there will be a procession that will step off from downtown Springfield. If you plan on going, you'll be able to see the Budweiser Clydesdales, MGM employees, construction workers, local leaders, and even some surprise entertainment. MGM is encouraging everyone to get there early because road closures and parking bans will be in effect. MGM held a news conference Thursday afternoon, and we got a little taste of what MGM Resorts is all about. Dozens of people gave speeches about opening day, including MGM Springfield President Mike Mathis. We also heard from Springfield Mayor Dominic Sarno, who has been a strong supporter of MGM Springfield since the very beginning. He said the $1 billion investment is just a third of the city's economic development, and more economic development also means more jobs. MGM Springfield has hired at least 1,000 residents from the city. What has come about now is that people would say, you know, well, what do you expect of Springfield? Now people are saying, why not Springfield? Thursday's news conference also ended with some Las Vegas style entertainment. The Jabberwockies wrapped up the news conference with a performance and I was there. Let me tell you, it was an incredible performance. Really cool stuff. Some people got the chance to step foot inside of the casino early for the VIP reception. Mayor Sarno, city councilors, and radio personalities Baxton O'Brien were some of the roughly 2,000 people there Thursday night. They walked around the casino's 125,000 square foot gaming floor and tried to hit the jackpot on the slot machines and card games. The plaza already had the stage ready to go for the Dropkick Murphys concert, which of course is taking place tomorrow night. We of course are hoping that the weather is good for that concert tomorrow night, but more importantly for today for the great grand opening of MGM Springfield and that procession. Let's check in with 22 News Storm Team Meteorologist Adam Stremko to see what we can expect. Well, Tamara, the good news, it looks like... Good morning. The time now is 6.52. We are live inside of MGM Springfield this morning, just hours, four hours before the grand opening, a moment that so many people in Springfield and Western Massachusetts have been waiting years for. So this is really cool. You can feel the excitement here at MGM Springfield, so I also hope that you're getting excited at home for everything that's happening today. We are live on the gaming floor right now. If you take a look behind me, you can see that everything is lit up. It's ready to go, and you'll want to soak this in because I guarantee this is the last time the gaming floor will be this empty. As soon as those doors open at 11 o'clock this morning, this will be packed with people playing the slots, ready to win big at MGM Springfield. MGM Springfield has several attractions, including a movie theater, a hotel, a bowling alley, stores, and restaurants. The history of Springfield is also scattered throughout the casino, including nods to Dr. Seuss, Emily Dickinson, and even yearbooks from local high schools. If you're planning on driving to MGM Springfield today, you may actually want to head over to West Springfield. 22 News reporter Taylor Knight is live at the Big E to show us where you can park. 
Good morning, Tamara. We are back at gate nine at the big E right now. And some people will head to downtown Springfield to catch a show. 22 News reporter Sierra Speller is live at the MGM Plaza to tell us what to expect this weekend. Well, you might be familiar with the song Shipping Up to Boston. It's been years in the making, but we're now just four hours away from the grand opening of MGM Springfield. A very exciting moment for people here in western Massachusetts. The city is expecting crowds in the thousands to make their way to this casino. Some people have seen this project as kind of a renaissance of Springfield, and we'll continue to bring you coverage of this throughout the day today. You can keep up with all things MGM Springfield related on air, online, and the 22 News mobile app. Time now is 6.55. You are watching a special edition of 22 News. Yes.